So what's up guys, this is Anara Chaudhary of As Group aka Isolation Media with some new video of color changing uh, in the last video Shambhu gave you one easy way to change the color of the cube uh, which we seen uh, all the levels that our color changes except I think the maze so let's start uh we will concentrate here about smooth camera uh, smooth uh change in material so let's start and i have a new f uh, game for you i have launched made by myself only uh it's the equilibrium uh please download it from is.io our we are isolation media there and just follow us it's a uh, infinite runner it's a good visual effect and so let's be back in our topic let's start so here is our that old project of so you can see uh, it's the old project so we want to change the material so let's create one object cube which will be named as material changer so here is our material changer uh, let's reset it position now we can see where it is oh no now let me reference it to player and change the position so that I can see now unparent it and you will see that material changes in the player position and now I can remove it from there and let's make it bigger and turn the mesh render off so it make it invisible and let's make it here so if our cube enters it just it changes our material i have a new material green color and you think i will add here one script uh, of course this trigger is on here but i will not add on one script i will add one tag name mat change i have added one but you can you have to add by making add tag and just type here mat change and there and assign it to material changer so now we will just mesh okay so let's start with our player script and you have seen in the last video i have also on the box collider which is not trigger is on means it has no trigger on and one capsule collider which has is trigger on means it is working as both collider and one trigger also so let's edit it now let's start simply make a private bool match change which uh, it will see that it will uh, the ma material is changing or not so just simple on trigger enter function now if other dot game object dot tag is equals equals match change means it enters the queue we have assigned then our match change bool becomes true and hence in the update function we will start with if match change because equals true then something is going to happen now what is going to happen we don't know so let's be sure about this now let's make one material uh, public so that we can access it access it material mat to change what happened 
and now this is our material to be changed and next one we will add one some word render uh, you don't know what render does but well, I'm predicting that you may know so if you don't know just go for unity documentation you can see that you, you have the renderer we can control the material from that so render uh, name it render only underscore render as a reserved keyword so here we are I gave underscore there now our renderer will take the mesh renderer component of our cube which is this and which uh, controls the material here you can see the materials are there which is brown so mesh uh, in, in, in the start function we will take the material so render is equal to uh, in case my cube is actor in my script so you can change it you can make it player so why I'm writing transform I don't know but sorry get component uh, mesh renderer uh, it is Visual Studio, so I am using shortcut. Uh, you can also download your tools. So, Messenger, just it. And now, we will change the material if match change is true. So, render dot sorry, huh, yes, dot material dot lerp is the function which changes the material from one material to another uh, it's a full void function means it has no return type so we have to write like this only so our earlier material was matte if you follow my video comma changes to matte to change Uh, in somewhat 0 0.08 f speed so we have our video here uh, now it may change the color anything I'm missing yeah I'm missing so we have to change the mad also means it is only changes the renderer so our initial material we have to change so mad dot mat is equal to our renderer dot material so it's perfectly transform the material I think go there and let's see what happens if I press start and here it's very late I think means very fast for us so make it one uh, now let's see now you can see it's fully smoothly changing like you know what in dancing line yes you can change the float value here to speed it up or make it some less one uh, but you know it's very dangerous to see that your thingy means what to say uh, somewhat one bug is occurring uh, let's start uh, here, let's pause it and you can see here this thing is appearing so you want to chill all the cubes here so you know how to use for each I have used for you only for each okay now you know uh, our all things are pawn here if you follow my video my residual cubes are pawn uh, if you clearly follow my video I think so so and it is collected with collection so we will use your for each statement for each game object and in collection we will change all the material of our array game array of game object oh, n dot 
get component mesh renderer which has the material becomes matte now our scripting is done and you can see our um, cube is perfectly changing with all the hues below and now we have a perfect change of color here so hooray let's see again so it was just a short video on how to color change it smoothly so thank you guys this is anayra to the as group and please check my new game equilibrium beta version because i don't have added the character change so i will soon add it it's a full infinite runner you will have very much fun just download it from istorials free you can also give me some donation if you like so thank you guys and you know what we are isolation media so thank you